Hello everyone. In my last video, I discussed the concept of KSA, which means knowledge, skill, and abilities. And in this video, we will see the seven domains of security and the related work areas of those domains. And in my next videos, you can see the mapping of these work areas to security domain positions. And finally, you can see the mapping of the related task and KSA to those positions. So moving further. to cover the whole security end to end nast divided the whole security in seven domains these seven domains are securely provision operate and maintain oversee and govern protect and defend analyze collect and operate investigate so let's take each domain one by one so the first domain is securely provision this domain covers all the activities related to the conceptualization design procurement and activities related to build secure it systems and even networks so all the work areas related to risk management software development system architecture technological research and development system requirement planning test and evaluation system development are under this domain the second domain is operate and maintain this domain covers all activities related to operation and maintenance of security devices and application such as to provide the support administration and maintenance necessary to ensure effective and efficient it system performance and security so all the work areas covering data administration knowledge management customer service and technical support network services system administration system analysis are covered in this domain the third domain is oversee and govern this domain help to provide leadership management direction or development and advocacy so the organization may effectively conduct cyber security work and the work areas under this domain are to provide legal advice and advocacy all the training education and awareness cyber security management strategic planning and policy executive cyber leadership and any work which is related to program project management and acquisition are also under this domain the next domain is protect and defend this domain help to identify analyze and mitigate threats to it systems and their networks and all the work related to cyber defense analysis cyber defense infrastructure support incident response vulnerability assessment and management comes under this domain the fifth domain is analyze which help to perform highly specialized review and evaluation of incoming cyber security information to determine its usefulness for intelligence this domain cover the work areas related to threat analysis exploitation analysis all source analysis targets and language analysis the sixth domain is collect and operate this domain provide specialized denial and deception operations and collection of cyber security information that may be used to develop cyber intelligence and it covers work areas such as collection operations cyber operational planning and cyber operations and the last domain is investigate which covers investigation of cyber security events or crimes related to it systems networks and digital evidence so it covers any work area related to cyber investigations and digital forensics every security professional roles and responsibilities lie in one or multiple overlapped security domains and it's very important for us to know our work areas and domain so in my next video i will show you what are the position in each work area and the knowledge skills and abilities required for those positions also i will provide a link of a google sheet which will help you to map the gap of your current ksas and the ksas required for the job you want to switch and you can also use the same sheet to create a complete career path by knowing the list of ksas for desired positions and setting a time bound completion target for those ksas so thank you friends and start working to know your domain and work areas in security